Um, apparently you guys haven't been able to understand where I'm coming from when I'm saying that I don't believe in evolution. Uh, that I'm going to make six videos on this and I'm going to uh, clarify what uh, Dr. Hoven says. Now, I want to like, talk about the uh, New World Order, but until you guys can understand that the government lies to you about evolution and other things, you're not going to listen to me. So, uh, this will be part one. Okay, let me uh, start out with the Big Bang. As Dr. Hovind says, there are six forms of, e of evolution. Now, I know you, you'll say that the Big Bang isn't uh, evolution because it's not animals. Yeah, no, that's true. Why is the Big Bang important? It's the Big Bang is important because it says there is no God. Uh, the Big Bang was supposed to be a singularity. Uh, what does that mean? Well, anyway, uh, a singularity is supposed to be a little, 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 little. A uh, dot, um, just like a black hole is big and then it goes into a, a dot, uh, a singularity is supposed to be the same thing. Now, um, so I've been asking atheists, and one of my uh, ten questions for atheists, um, why don't black holes make universes? And somebody responded saying um, that the uh, singularity that created the universe was way bigger than the black holes we have today. Okay, there's a problem with that. Uh, the bigger a black hole is, the stronger its gravity, its gravitational force. The uh, larger you make something, or um, or like the smaller you can uh, push something together, the stronger the gravitational force will be. Where did the singularity come from? Because like the Big Bang says there was nothing except for the singularity. Uh, anyway, uh, if you understand s string theory, they say that um, the universes pop into existence and out for eternity. They're always uh, expanding and then contrasting and forever. But the problem is scientists have actually discovered that there isn't enough gravitational force to pull everything back together. So uh, our universe will never uh, collapse and then make another universe. So. Um, that's another problem for the Big Bang. And, uh, if you want to talk about the Big Bang, um, well, it would not explode. Things do not happen for no reason. Things do not start spinning and then go, oh, okay, that doesn't happen. Um, and that, like there was no oxygen 
or anything else for there to be an explosion. Um, and for there to be an explosion, you need uh, molecules like the uh, sun is is uh, helium and hydrogen um, forcing it into uh, nuclear reactions. Well, the uh, Big Bang says there is no molecules. Well, if there's no molecules, there's not going to be an explosion, and there's not going to be any heat. Um, I have a physics book that uh, states that the temperature of the explosion was 1,800 trillion degrees Fahrenheit, or 1.8 quadrillion degrees. If you have no molecules, you have no explosion, and if you have no explosion, you have no heat. So I don't know where they got that number. They made it up just as... God! There is no proof of it whatsoever. Um, I believe that in the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. That makes more sense than the Big Bang. Why? Because for all eternity, something had to exist for anything to exist, because as Venom Thing X uh, shows you, Um, nothing can make nothing. Something has to make something. So, being that uh, the Bible says God is beyond our understanding, He is beyond the universe, He can make something that's less complex than Himself. And the Bible also says he has infinite energy, so that means that no matter how big the universe is, it's not a problem for God whatsoever. Where, I don't know um, if you've ever seen anything uh, be created from an explosion. But if you've seen anything be created, like in Iraq where the, uh, you would see the uh, tanks blow up. I don't know how far the, uh, the debris would go. 100 feet, 300 feet, something like that. But it, it didn't go on forever where the, the Big Bang supposedly created an explosion that goes on forever. Mm -hmm.